So there is some confirmation. And it any, comes any sort of takers, though. It right? comes directly <laughs> from the chief tweet himself, Elon Musk. He tweeted out after a lot of speculation because he'd gone quiet for a bit that he will resign as Twitter CEO. He said, quote, as soon as I find someone foolish enough to take the job. After that, he says, I will just run the software and server teams. So it's clear he plans to focus on the engineering teams going forward. Now, it has been a rather chaotic reign since Musk first bought out Twitter, taking it private in late October for $44 billion, taking on a lot of debt on the company and certainly uh, causing major disruption. Uh, there were mass firings, mass resignations. Uh, a lot of the advertisers were spooked. Revenue was down. And there were questions about policy changes and so much criticism over the weekend. Musk polled followers, should I step down? A majority said yes, he should, and he's been quiet in the 24, 48 hours since then till now. Four people at least put their hands in the air, uh, and others were put forward as possible successors to Musk. Two of them, uh, David Sachs and Jason Calacanis, are known friends of Musk and well-known in the tech industry who helped in Musk's war room slightly after he took over. Meanwhile, there's big focus there are the four. Uh, they're a big focus once again on Twitter stock, which is often served now as a uh, on Tesla stock, which is served as a proxy for Twitter. Let's take a look at a tweet that Musk lashed out out just a couple hours ago, and it comes from a major Tesla investor, a major supporter, uh, who said, hey, uh, Tesla stock price now reflects the value of having no CEO, time for a shakeup, and Musk responded in a tweet, please tell us your great ideas, a sarcastic tweet, it would seem. But if you drop into the Bloomberg, you'll see it is down some 60 percent year to date. Tesla stock has been on a steady decline. It missed out on the brief upswing in shares. And again, there will be big focus on Tesla when we open up Wednesday in U.S. trading. Uh, Sue, what's this about the FTC? Well, it's just another headache for uh, Musk. Uh, we know that the FTC had been reviewing uh, Tesla, uh, Tesla's CEO since he took over at Twitter. And the question was security and privacy issues. Sources close to the matter tell us the investigation has intensified and two former Twitter executives have been questioned. Again, the questions having to do with whether important regulations that Twitter's previous management had agreed to with the FTC are being followed that have to do with user privacy and uh, security issues, an exodus of staff since Musk took over in its legal privacy and compliancy divisions have escalated concerns and we're told that this is now a review going forward. Separately, police in California are reportedly looking into a vehicular accident that may involve security members or at least one security member of Musk's private detail. Back to you.